Okay, guys, so basically, like I was saying, here, get this turned around here. There we go. So basically, like I was saying, um, you can see, you can see pretty much how clean this is. Oh, yeah, I need to cut that still. Um, it looks like a mirror. I mean, literally a mirror. It's crazy. Um, but yeah, so like I said, you need to pretty much make sure that you're going slow. You go in straight, um, you know, straight lines all the way across the wrap. Just make sure, you know, that you are in fact, um, uh, making sure there are no air bubbles because trust me, if this thing hits any heat, you're screwed. You're hundred percent screwed because it's just going to bubble, bubble, bubble. And then you're going to, you're going to be so mad. Um, I'm going to close the camera real quick because I don't know if I showed you guys, but, um, I do have one of my taillights in and I'm going to get that video up soon, but well, you know what? Should I show you? You know what? Screw it. I'm going to show you guys. So here is the first look at my taillights on the truck. If I'm being honest, and I'm being honest, I don't know. I don't know if I like, I don't know if I like the black. Which means I don't know if I want to paint it gray. Comment, comment down below and, and let me know what you guys think. But I mean, if we're being honest, I I do like the black. I think if I get once I get the rear bumper on, um, once I get the rear bumper on and some other like you know red like the hitch on eventually and all that, I think I think I won't really care anymore at that point. But like if you look at all these other big big builds, you know, usually almost. Okay, maybe not every, but about half of them have their tail lights color matched to whatever you know color their truck is. So go ahead and comment down below and let me know what you think I should do when it comes to uh, the color of the tail lights. Um, yeah, definitely a definitely something I'm gonna have to think about. But anyway, as I was saying, so. You know, as you can see with all of these creases right here, um, these take some time because, you know, you gotta lay in. You gotta lay into all of these creases. Otherwise, you know, you're gonna, it's, it's gonna fail. So, um, just make sure that you, that you are doing that um, with whatever car or vehicle you're wrapping because it is, very important um, to have on your vehicle. But um, like I said, uh, once you get laying down, it's pretty straightforward as of laying. Um, I mean, other than laying, I would say that cutting is also kind of a pain in the butt because when you're cutting, if you see, when you're cutting these edges here, you really, really gotta, gotta have a line to cut on. I mean, if you, you literally can see, I mean, it's gotta be, I mean, it's got to be pretty much precise everywhere. Because, you know, one little miscut or one little, one little screw up, you're gonna, <laughs> you're gonna have problems. So, um, you know, it's a hard one, but yeah. So anyway, like I said, um, that's pretty much all there is to wrapping. It's not as easy as it sounds. I make it probably sound a little easy, but in general, I would say it's probably, it's very intermediate when it comes to making sure it's done correctly and it'll last you a long time. So, um, like I said, the gas cap, uh, I do think I'm going to go ahead and put that 
in this video right now after uh, this part of the video because um, I will be doing that real quick before I go uh, go in for the night. But um, yeah, like I said, it's really coming together. I am so excited for this truck. Uh, I mean, as you saw in the video, uh, a couple videos prior, us putting the um, the trailer trailer harness on for the hitch, and just basically, actually, I don't know if I showed you guys these yet, but these knuck or yeah, the knuckles. Jeez, that's loud. The knuckles for um, the leaf springs are at least set in and mounted. Um, well, nice and lollipop red. I haven't bolted anything down, obviously, because the leaf springs aren't uh, aren't in. But uh, let's see here. Yeah, see, all good to go. Just need to tighten it down when we're ready. Look at that red. Oh, that's just gonna look so killer. Anyway. Like I said, um, I'm gonna tilt you sideways. Like I said, that is about it for the video today. I will throw in the gas cap clip here in the end. But like I said, we are going very far with this truck, and it is coming, coming very far as well. The last thing, actually, you know what? I'm gonna save that for the next video later on here. Um, I might actually go ahead and film it tonight and then post it later in the week. Um, but some cool things coming still. Uh, but like I said, tell me about the taillights and we will catch all of you guys in the next video. See you guys later.